One of the new features that's available in our 2018 2.0 release of the Destiny Estimator um, is our ability to aggregate formulaic WBS properties or formulaic properties on the 2D takeoff components. Uh, what that means is, for example, here I've got a 12 inch duct work and a 24 inch duct work. Um, for this duct work, we've got a couple of properties here. Um, we've added a duct height property, and we've told that in this case it was 12, and then we've added a, a duct area property, and we made that one formulaic. And so the area is the length of that takeoff times the duct height. We've done the same thing for the 24 inch, except for its duct height is 24 inches. And so if I select on one of these pieces of takeoff here, in this case the 24 inch duct, you can see that it's got a duct height of 24, but its duct area is 1,800 uh, square feet. And then for the 12 inch, you can see the same, the same concept here. Now, if I start to select multiple of these components in previous versions, that would not aggregate. And one of the things that's really great about our 2018 2.0 version is that it does aggregate and you can see the various different values used um, because you have multiple 2D components selected. And as I continue to select more, it will continue to aggregate and I can use this value with all of my ducts selected and tie that to any one or more line items.